Hello, this is the Cambridge Assessment English Pre A1 Starters Listening Test. Look at part one. Now look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. I know the people here, Grandpa. Do you? Yes. Can you see that boy? He's looking at the fish in the water. Oh yes. Is his name Sam? Yes, that's right. Sam loves fish. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. One. Who's that man? He's sitting next to the flowers. That's my dad's friend. His name's Tom. Is he eating a burger? Yes, that's Tom's favorite food. Two. There's my mom's friend Alice too. Where? She's got birds on her jacket. Oh yes, she's got a big bag. Yes, Alice comes to the stores a lot. Three. What's the name of that girl? She's pointing to the dog. Her name's Grace. Is Grace with her brother? Yes, she is. Four. Can you see the boy with the plane? Yes. His name's Mark. Does Mark like planes? Yes, that's his new one. Five. And do you know that woman? She's walking in front of the toy shop. Oh yes, that's my teacher. Her name's May. May's a nice name. Yes, and she's a very nice teacher. Can we go to the toy shop and say hello to her? Okay. Now listen to part one again. One. Who's that man? He's sitting next to the flowers. That's my dad's friend. His name's Tom. Is he eating a burger? Yes, that's Tom's favorite food. Two. There's my mom's friend Alice too. Where? She's got birds on her jacket. Oh yes, she's got a big bag. Yes, Alice comes to the stores a lot. Three. What's the name of that girl? She's pointing to the dog. Her name's Grace. Is Grace with her brother? Yes, she is. Four. Can you see the boy with the plane? Yes. His name's Mark. Does Mark like planes? Yes, that's his new one. Five. And do you know that woman? She's walking in front of the toy shop. Oh yes, that's my teacher. Her name's May. May's a nice name. Yes, and she's a very nice teacher. Can we go to the toy shop and say hello to her? Okay. That is the end of part one. Part two. Look at the picture. Listen, and write a name or a number. There are two examples. Hello, what's your name? It's Bill. Bill, do you spell that B I L L? Yes. And how 
old are you? I'm seven. Seven? Yes, that's right. Can you see the answers? Now you listen and write a name or a number. One. What are you drawing, Bill? It's a picture of a monster. It's a girl monster. It's very good. Has she got a name? Yes. Her name's Candy. That's C A N D Y. Candy. That's a cool name for a monster. Thanks. Two. How old is your monster? She's fifteen. Fifteen years old. Does she go to school? Yes, she does. She likes school a lot. That's good. Three. Where is the monster's school? It's in Lemon Street. You spell that L E M O N. Lemon? Do the children in that school like fruit? Yes, they do. Four. Has the monster got a big family? Yes, she's got ten sisters. Ten sisters! Wow. Yes, it's a lot. Five. And has the monster got a brother? Yes. One, his name's Jump. Jump, is that J U M P? Yes, he's very small. He's a baby, and his big sister loves him a lot. Now listen to part two again. One. What are you drawing, Bill? It's a picture of a monster. It's a girl monster. It's very good. Has she got a name? Yes. Her name's Candy. That's C A N D Y. Candy. That's a cool name for a monster. Thanks. Two. How old is your monster? She's fifteen. Fifteen years old. Does she go to school? Yes, she does. She likes school a lot. That's good. Three. Where is the monster's school? It's in Lemon Street. You spell that. L E M O N. Lemon. Do the children in that school like fruit? Yes, they do. Four. Has the monster got a big family? Yes, she's got ten sisters. Ten sisters! Wow. Yes. It's a lot. Five. And has the monster got a brother? Yes, one. His name's Jump. Jump. Is that J U M P? Yes. He's very small. He's a baby, and his big sister loves him a lot.
That is the end of part two. Part three. Look at the pictures. Now listen and look. There is one example. What sport is Mark playing? Where's Mark? Is he playing table tennis? No, he's in the park with his friends. Are they playing hockey? No, they're playing basketball today. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. Where can Kim put the pencils? Mr. Black, where can I put the pencils? In the cupboard. Uh, don't put them there, Kim. Put them next to the computer. The one on the bookcase. No, the one on my desk. Two. What is Lucy wearing? Is that Lucy, the girl with the glasses? Lucy doesn't wear glasses, Mom. Look, that's her. She's wearing a dress. And boots? No, she's got shoes on today. Three. What animals can Ben see at the zoo today? This zoo is great, Dad. Where are the lizards? They don't have those here, Ben. But there are hippos there. Look. They're very ugly. I don't like them. Can we go and see the zebras? Not today. Let's go home now. Oh, Dad. Four. What is Dan's mum doing? Where's your mum, Dan? Is she making dinner? No, she's in the living room. Is she watching TV? No, she's talking on the phone to Grandpa. Oh. Five. How can Eva go to school today? Oh dear, Dad, I can't walk to school today. I've got a lot of books. Go on your bike. It's at my friend's house. Oh, Eva, come with me in the car then. But I'm going now. Now listen to part three again. One. Where can Kim? Put the pencils. Mr. Black, where can I put the pencils? In the cupboard. Uh, don't put them there, Kim. Put them next to the computer. The one on the bookcase. No, the one on my desk. Two. What is Lucy wearing? Is that Lucy? The girl with the glasses. Lucy doesn't wear glasses, Mom. Look, that's her. She's wearing a dress. And boots? No, she's got shoes on today. Three. What animals can Ben see at the zoo today? This zoo is great, Dad. Where are the lizards? They don't have those here, Ben. But there are hippos there. Look. They're very ugly. I don't like them. Can we go and see the zebras? Not today. Let's go home now. Oh, Dad. Four. What is Dan's mum doing? Where's your mum, Dan? 
Is she making dinner? No, she's in the living room. Is she watching TV? No, she's talking on the phone to Grandpa. Oh. Five. How can Eva go to school today? Oh dear, Dad, I can't walk to school today. I've got a lot of books. Go on your bike. It's at my friend's house. Oh, Eva, come with me in the car then. But I'm going now. That is the end of part three. Part four. Look at the picture. Listen, and look. There is one example. Look at this picture of a kitchen. The children are having lunch. Yes, it's nice. They like apples in that house. Yes, let's color them. Can you color the apple on the table? The apple on the table? Okay, I'm coloring that red. Good. Can you see the red apple? This is an example. Now you listen and color. One. There is an apple on the tree. On the tree? Yes. Look in the garden. Oh yes. What color is that apple? Uh, green. Okay. Do it that color. And now I'd like to do a yellow apple. Right. Which apple is that color? Can you see that one on the floor? Next to the train? Yes, that's right. I'm coloring that apple now. Three. What now? I'd like to color that apple. Which one? On the boy's T-shirt. I'm doing it pink. The apple on the boy's T-shirt. Okay. Four. There's an apple on the door. Oh yes. Can you do that apple brown? The apple on the door? Yes, please. Right. I'm doing that apple now. Five. There's a funny poster on the wall. Yes, there is. Would you like to color the apple on the poster? Right. What color? Ah,、uh, blue. Oh, okay. There. That's a great picture now. Now listen to part four again. One. There is an apple on the tree. On the tree? Yes. Look in the garden. Oh yes. What color is that apple? Uh, 
Green? Okay. Do it that color. Two. And now I'd like to do a yellow apple. Right. Which apple is that color? Can you see that one on the floor? Next to the train? Yes, that's right. I'm coloring that apple now. Three. What now? I'd like to color that apple. Which one? On the boy's t-shirt. I'm doing it pink. The apple on the boy's t-shirt. Okay. Four. There's an apple on the door. Oh, yes. Can you do that apple brown? The apple on the door? Yes, please. Right. I'm doing that apple now. Five. There's a funny poster on the wall. Yes, there is. Would you like to color the apple on the poster? Right. What color? Uh, blue. Oh, okay. There. That's a great picture now. That is the end of the Pre-A1 Starters Listening Test.